Father, you created all things, and we praise you for crafting the beautiful land of Rwanda. You shaped thousands of hills across this small country, and you caused the springs to flow in the valley, supplying water for every living thing. You gave life to 12 million men, women, and children who live in Rwanda, and you know them by name. Father, it's been more than 20 years since the genocide of 1994, where thousands of lives were lost in just a hundred days. We praise you for restoring peace since that traumatic time. Thank you for pouring out your healing to so many. We stand in awe of those who chose to forgive the people who took away their loved ones. We ask that your spirit would bring even more renewal where there is still pain, resentment, and prejudice. We lift up the church in Rwanda, Father, the Bride of Christ. Though many churches responded poorly during the genocide, we thank you for giving them a new identity as they share the good news of redemption. We ask now that the church would be an active agent of unity and reconciliation. We ask for godly leaders, unity among believers, joy in your presence, and excitement to see your kingdom come in every community and every heart in this nation. We lift up those who are struggling, God, those who are widowed or orphaned, hungry or sick, jobless or lonely, or have no way to send their children to school. We pray for those who see no reason to hope. Where poverty seems overwhelming, please provide for these families' needs. Comfort them and renew them with your strength and promises. God, we lift up the work of Hope International and its partners in Rwanda. We praise you for the savings ministries for the four denominational church partners that represent thousands of Rwandan churches, and for the nearly 200,000 men and women participating in local saving groups. Please bless these members as they work hard to provide for their families, save together, and use those savings in their businesses, homes, churches, and communities. Work through these groups to reach those who don't know you, to bond members together in love, and to make disciples. God, we thank you for Hope's microfinance partner, Owego. We praise you for the nearly 400,000 men and women who have access to savings accounts, business loans, and other financial services through Owego's ministry. We pray these tools would equip clients to care for their families, bless the work of their hands so that they can become agents of change and restoration in their communities. God, we pray that you would use these programs to transform hearts and communities spiritually, materially, personally, and socially. We long to see the gospel take root and capture the hearts of those in the cities and in the countryside. Father, we thank you for the ways that you are moving in Rwanda, and we look forward with anticipation to see what you will do in the future. We pray all this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.